Hi, welcome to Tag Div's tutorial section. In this video, we'll show you how to build astonishing pages using predefined blocks and modules. To create a new page, go to your WordPress admin sidebar, Pages, Add New. This is going to be my new home page. You must give it a title. Now, let's build it using the Visual Composer. Click on the Backend Editor button to start. Visual Composer allows you to add elements, for example, a text block. But it also helps you design your new page, suggesting predefined home page template. These predefined templates are the ones you can see on the theme demos. On the right side, you will find the page attributes. This template comes with an article list with pagination. The latest article is similar to the one displayed on the blog page, but in this case allows you to add your desired elements on top of this section using Visual Composer. Let's just click one of these predefined templates. I will choose the home page, video template. But I'm not going to use video files, but usual text and image content. Click on the template to select it. Now all the rows, blocks, sidebar and boxes are already imported on my new page. Now click Publish to save settings. Yes, it's that simple. If you want to remove elements or add new ones, the theme allows you to do it easily. Just press the plus icon here and add a new row. This is going to be added at the end of the page. Now click this icon to add a block inside the row. Here are all the elements and blocks you can combine on your page or on a post. I want to add a new slider to my home page. Click on it to add it to the page. The block settings panel automatically opens to configure this block. In this case, I will set the slider auto play speed, the number of posts, a custom title and colors. Under the Filter tab, I choose to filter the displayed post by category and select Latest on the Sort Order drop-down box. When you're done setting up this block, click the Save Changes button. To move this block, you have to press and hold here, then drag and reorder the blocks. You can drop it when the desired area is gray like this one. Now click Publish or Update to save the settings. Done! Remember, the page or post settings override the global settings. For more in-depth information, please refer to our theme documentation. I hope you'll enjoy building new pages for your website as much as I am using themes for smart people. Thank you for watching.